How to draw a face with Mr. Goodwin. Okay, we're going to start off by drawing the general shape of the head. And we're looking to draw just like an oval shape, a bit like an egg shape. I'm holding my pencil very lightly, very loosely, just bringing that round. And this doesn't have to be perfect yet. This will change as we, as we go on. You might want to turn the paper around a bit to help you with that. Okay, so we've got the general shape of the head there, slightly oval, slightly thin at the bottom, then the top. Now we're going to imagine there's a line coming down the middle here. So very, very, very faintly, I'm just going to draw that on there. Okay, and then I'm going to cut the, the head in half again, horizontally, across here. Now our eyes eventually will sit along this line here. Looking at this line here where our eyes are going to be and the bottom of our chin, I'd like to cut that in half and just draw a very faint line there. And that's where the bottom of your nose will come to there. From here where our bottom of our nose is to where our chin is, Again, we're going to need to cut that line in half and that's where our mouth will be. Okay, let's start with this eye here. Now the middle of the eye should be around the middle between from here to here. I'm just going to draw the shape of our eye like so. It looks a little bit like the shape of a lemon there and you can see the middle around there we'll come back to that eye a little bit later on the next eye again and draw around so the middle is halfway between here and here we've got the middle there i'm just going to put the shape of the eye around there now they should be the same shape our nose is going to come to the bottom here. The bottom of our nose will come to here. Your nose, imagine a line going from here down and here. So your nostrils should sit between your eye here and here. So. And the bottom of your nose, just feel there. Now looking at our mouth, okay, we drew this line earlier for the mouth. If underneath this line, we draw a curved line from here across, okay? Give it a bit of a smile there. The pupil, so the middle of the eye, should line up with the edge of the smile, okay? Approximately around that, that sort of size. Okay, so we've got the width of the mouth across there. On top of this line, we can add a sort of curved shape on top of there, one side of the lip, and then the other side of the lip. So we've got that a bit of a dip in the middle, just there. And now we're going back to the eyes. We're just going to add a bit more detail in. Most right to its correct a bit of the shape of the eye, and then we add the pupils in, the eyelid in, okay, 
And all the time being very, very light with your pencil. So you can change it, come back to it. If needs be. Okay, onto the other eye now. Okay, now we're going to look at the eyebrows. And the eyebrows sit just above the eyes, and everyone will have different eyebrows, so you just do it how it fits with the person you're drawing, yourself, or so if we add those on, like so. Now the ears need to start around level with your eye to about the bottom of your nose. And you just put two marks there and again on the other side, but so they are the same size each side. If you just want to draw the shape of the ear in like so. Coming down just a little bit lower from the ear, we need to add our neck in. So just a straight line down each side. You can add a bit of a curve to it if you want. Show where the shoulders will start. When we add our hair, obviously everybody have, has different hair. I'm just going to start adding a few lines in. Show where the hair is there. And the hair will also cover the top line of the shape of the head that we drew earlier on. get rid of any of those lines that we drew before just to mark out where things were going and that's why we drew them very lightly so we could rub them out any bits that you need to fill in just do so you can now add any colour or detail you wish to.